Olha só que bacana, uma universidade de Presidente Prudente. Check this out. A university in Presidente Prudente, São Paulo, now has a photovoltaic solar plant with 3.12 megawatts. It's the biggest in the state and one of the biggest in Brazil and high consumption. Now we'll hear about the benefits. The installation area of the university's photovoltaic plant is equivalent to a bit more than four soccer fields like Maracanã Stadium, the biggest in the country. The panels are enough, for example, to supply 2,500 homes. An investment of $3 million that will be paid back shortly by the electric bill that will be about 80% less. Essa conta, ela era substancial, você está falando... This bill menos, was substantial. We are cursos, talking about two campuses. Basically, here at Campus 2, we have 200 classrooms, 60 labs and clinics, and the biggest VAT hospital in the region. All of this with lights and air conditioning. And we expect to reduce in 80% the cost we had with electricity. Mechanism that makes this plant the biggest in the state and one of the biggest in Brazil, in a model called distributed generation high consumption. Solar energy is already a reality in Brazil. The cost benefit is getting better. The cost of equipment is decreasing and the cost of energy getting higher. So this conversion factor makes the payback and return over investment to happen faster. So we estimate here at the campus this investment to be paid in five or six years. And the plant will be working for 25 to 30 years. The photovoltaic energy is the energy obtained directly from the conversion of the sunlight into electricity. The project that took a year is an important accomplishment to the university. Beyond the financial savings, sustainability through a clean energy the plant will be part of the process to train future professionals. The university invests in quality to make available the best return on quality, return on research and social return to the supplied community. So, it's beneficial to all of our collaborators in special. Enough reasons to get the attention of global leaders engaged and worried about the world's health. Tomás is the founder of the Solar Business Club, an arm of Solar Future Today that connects leaders all over the globe to shape and lead the transition to a better world. And I think uh, it's a very important message that uh, Brazil will be one of the most important countries which will be driving the exponential growth of the world. And uh, with solar energy, clean technologies, Brazil can become the leader of the world. E é muito importante nós ressaltarmos que o Brasil ele tem um papel fundamental nesse mercado que vai crescer de bilhões para trilhões, nessa transição para uma energia limpa. Então, nós acreditamos que o Brasil pode se tornar líder nessa tecnologia.